Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make this super easy, basically two ingredient hand sanitizer for cheap because right now all of the hand sanitizer is sold out at stores due to the coronavirus and a lot of people are asking some DIY methods to making some hand sanitizer. So here is what I found and it works fabulously. So far I've used it an abundance of time. Now guys, I'm not gonna lie, I am somebody who just chronically stocks up on cleaning products and sanitary products often, so I don't necessarily need these, but I'm going to show you how to make them. So guys, when you go to the store and you can no longer find hand sanitizer, this is how you make it. Let's go ahead and get started. For this recipe, you'll need some sort of bottles. I got all of these bottles at a Target. They were just a little over a dollar. Um, if you want to have your hand sanitizer smell like anything, you'll just need some type of essential oil or soap oil. I'm using a relaxing blend. I have a couple different options, but I actually really like this one. It is kind of like relaxing and kind of menthol -y. It smells good. You'll need 100% aloe vera gel, and you'll also need some rubbing alcohol. So the first thing we want to do is use a one-third cup to measure out the aloe vera gel and the alcohol. We are going to measure out two thirds cup of alcohol. Next, we are going to measure out one third cup of the aloe vera gel. Um, as you can probably get the idea of, the magic solution for this is um, one part aloe vera gel to two parts rubbing alcohol. That is um, basically the gist of it. So if you want to make more or less, you'll just have to convert the, oops, we'll just have to convert the measurements for that. And we're gonna splash them on in there. The next thing I'm doing is I'm just going to add in some of this relaxing blend soap expressions, soap scent. I got this from Hobby Lobby in case anybody wants to get one just like this. Hobby Lobby does have this there, so I'm just gonna add some drops in there and call it a day. So right now it just kind of looks like this and I'm gonna go ahead and mix this around. I have my little partner in crime here. Hi, sweetie. Mm. She wanted to help, but when I told her that the alcohol might hurt her eyes if she splashes, she no longer wanted to help. So we are going to mix, 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 mix. So I went ahead and added some more oil in there. It just kind of made it look cloudy. You can also add in some soap glycerin to it if you need to help thicken it up a little bit or you just want a little bit more of um, like a moisturizing type liquid, then go ahead and do that. But that is it. So now we are going to place it into our bottles. I am gonna go ahead and use this funnel to get it into our bottles and go from there. Alrighty, here we have it. You can see we have made our hand sanitizer. So I'm just gonna show you guys approximately how thick it is. I'm just going to put it on my hands and then I will kind of like let it run down my hands so you can see. Some people like really, really thick hand sanitizer and other people just like it to be a little bit liquidy and this with this is a little bit more liquidy as you can kind of see, but it does absorb in pretty easily and because of the aloe vera, it's slightly moisturizing as well, which is really nice, especially for this mom who has to clean up messes and do the dishes a thousand times a day. So there you have it guys. There is how you make homemade DIY hand sanitizer. I do wanna to mention to you guys that some people are saying depending on the brand of alcohol and the brand of aloe they're using that it is separating in the bottle and that's totally fine if that happens. Shake it up a little bit and you're ready to go. It still has all the ingredients in it and it will kill all of those bad viruses. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that it has been helpful to you in some way. Please leave me a comment down below and stay healthy guys. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye.